Welcome children. This is an English lesson for the 5th standard and the name of the lesson is Dictionary Skills. Lesson number 5 on page 29 in your textbook. Now all of you must be having a dictionary at home. If not, I advise you to buy a dictionary because we need it for our reference. Whenever you want to see a meaning of a word, instead of typing it on Google and searching, the best method is to look up a dictionary. So, let us read on page 29. Hi, my name is Dictionary. I am the master of all the words and meanings that you can find in the English language. I am a word wizard. I am very helpful, you know. If you become my friend, and learn to make use of me well, you can become a word wizard too. So this, the dictionary is talking about itself. It's giving a self-introduction, what it is. So it says it's a book with all the words and meanings that help you in the English language. And it's a word wizard. Word wizard means it's a master of words. And a person who reads the dictionary or makes use of the dictionary will also become a word wizard so that is what the dictionary is giving as an introduction to us next paragraph i have a treasure chest of words inside my pages you guessed right i'm a book let's open the treasure chest and start digging out the treasures inside my pages so the dictionary says it's a treasure chest that means a box full of treasure not of gold or silver or diamonds a treasure of words inside the pages so now we realize a dictionary is a book Third paragraph, the first thing you must know about me is that I am an orderly person. That means everything is in an order. Nothing is out of order. Everything is very systematically arranged. You will never find my words just thrown anywhere and anyhow. So the words in a dictionary are not arranged helter scatter. It is all arranged serial wise in a very uh, sequential order. It is not at all arranged in a hayway wire manner. So that is what the dictionary says. It is a very orderly arranged book. All my words are, next page, always in an alphabetical order. If you know A, B, C in order, you will soon be able to find any word inside my pages. So the dictionary says, if you know your alphabets well, A to Z, you will be able to trace out any word in the dictionary very, very easily. Look, here are some words. Look at the first letter of each word. Can you arrange these words in alphabetical order? Monkey, alligator, ponder, baboon, quite, radish and cry. The first word in your list will be alligator because it begins with the first letter of the alphabet. So in that list of random words, the first word that you will write in alphabetical order will be alligator because it begins with A, the first letter of the alphabet. That was an easy exercise, wasn't it? Now look at these list of words. They all begin with the same letter. How will you arrange words which begin with the same letter in the alphabetical order? Open me and see how the words are listed. All the words begin with the same letter and yet they are in alphabetical order. You can write words in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of the word. Here are three sets of words which begin with the same letter each. Write each set in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of each word. So when I say alligator, bat, cat, the first word will be alligator because it let, uh, begins with A. Obviously the second word will be bat because it begins with B. Third word will be the one beginning with C. But if all the words that I give you maybe starting with A. Now you are in a fix as to which word will be the first one. Then what you do is you need to look at the second letter in that word and then arrange it. So now you see the first uh, group of words there. Bangle, boat, beeline, buckle. Bangle, boat, beeline, buckle. Now all the four words begin with B. But then the second letter is A. So bangle has to be arranged first. Then comes B after bangle, A, B, C, D, E. So next word will be B line. After that, you will have 
A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O. So next word will be boat and the last word will be buckle. So that is how you have to arrange. You have to see the first letter, then the second and sometimes the first and second are also same. Then you go on to the third one. Now, for your homework, you will have to do the next one. Daughter, doll, dimple, duckling. Pants, purse, polite, proper. So these three tables you need to complete in your textbook. Now, for reading homework, I will read through the lesson from page 29 to 30. And you will listen to me and take a voice message and send it to the school number. Dictionary skills. Hi, my name is Dictionary. I am the master of all the words and meanings that you can find in the English language. I am a word wizard. I am very helpful, you know. If you become my friend and learn to make use of me, well, you can become a word wizard too. I have a treasure chest of words inside my pages. You guessed right. I am a book. Let's open the treasure chest and start digging out the treasures inside my pages. The first thing you must know about me is that I am an orderly person. You will never find my words just thrown anywhere and anyhow. All my words are always in an alphabetical order. If you know A, B, C in order, you will soon be able to find any word inside my pages. Look, here are some words. Look at the first letter of each word. Can you arrange these words in an alphabet in alphabetical order? Monkey, alligator, ponder, baboon, quite, radish and cry. The first word in your list will, would, will be alligator because it begins with the first letter of the alphabet. That was an easy exercise, wasn't it? Now look at these lists of words. They all begin with the same letter. How will you arrange words which begin with the same letter in the alphabetical order? Open me and see how the words are listed. All the words begin with the same letter and yet they are in the alphabetical order. You can write words in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of the word. Here are three sets of words which begin with the same letter each. Write each set in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of each word. Dictionary skills. Hi, my name is Dictionary. I am the master of all the words and meanings that you can find in the English language. I am a word wizard. I am very helpful, you know. If you become my friend and learn to make use of me, well, you can become a word wizard too. I have a treasure chest of words inside my pages. You guessed right. I am a book. Let's open the treasure chest and start digging out the treasures inside my pages. The first thing you must know about me is that I am an orderly person. You will never find my words just thrown anywhere and anyhow. All my words are always in an alphabetical order. If you know A, B, C in order, you will soon be able to find any word inside my pages. Look, here are some words. Look at the first letter of each word. Can you arrange these words in an alphabet in alphabetical order? Monkey, alligator, ponder, baboon, quite, radish and cry. The first word in your list will, would, will be alligator because it begins with the first letter of the alphabet. That was an easy exercise, wasn't it? Now look at these lists of words. They all begin with the same letter. How will you arrange words which begin with the same letter in the alphabetical order? Open me and see how the words are listed. All the words begin with the same letter and yet they are in the alphabetical order. You can write words in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of the word. Here are three sets of words which begin with the same letter each. Write each set in the alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of each word. Dictionary Skills My name is Dictionary.
I am the master of all the words and meanings that you can find in the English language. I am a word wizard. I'm very helpful, you know. If you become my friend and learn to make use of me, well, you can become a word wizard too. I have a treasure chest of words between my pages. You guessed right. I am a book. Let's open the treasure chest and start digging out the treasures between my pages. The first thing you must know about me is that I am a very orderly person. You will never find words just thrown anywhere and anyhow. All my words are always in alphabetical order. If you know your ABC in the right order, then you will soon be able to find any word you want between my pages. Look, here are some words. Look at the first letter of each word. Can you put these words in alphabetical order? Do this in your notebooks. The first word in your list will be alligator because it begins with the first letter of the alphabet. Now continue with the list. That was an easy exercise, wasn't it? Now look at these lists of words. They all begin with the same letter. How will you put words which begin with the same letter in alphabetical order? Open me and see how the words are listed. All the words begin with the same letter, but they are still in alphabetical order. You can put words into alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of the word. Here are three sets of words beginning with the same letter. Try and put each set in alphabetical order by looking at the second letter of each word. So far, so good. Here's another difficulty. If first two letters of the words that follow are the same, how do we manage the alphabetical order part of it? We have to look at the third letter of each word and then put the words in alphabetical order. Here are three sets of words. Arrange each in alphabetical order by looking at the third letter of every word. I think you're becoming quite good at reading me now. There are a few things you have to remember when you handle me. Remember that words beginning with the letters A to M are in my first half. The second half will give you words beginning with the letters N to Z. So if you want to look up the meaning of the word zoo, then you will find it somewhere towards the end. Look at one of my pages. Let's see what it says. The first word on the page at top left is the guide word. The last word on the right-hand page is the same as the guide word on the top right-hand corner. All the words that are going to be defined or described are written in large and bold black type. They are called entry words. These words will come in alphabetical order. Now open me. Here is a list of words. Find the guide word at the top of the page on which these words are. Write the guide word. Here is a list of guide words. Below the guide words are a list of entry words. If you think the entry words will appear within the same pages as the guide words, write yes next to it. If not, write no.
if you manage to do these exercises, then you really are getting clever with me. Do you know something very confusing about the English language? Some words which are spelt in the same way and pronounced the same way have different meanings. Don't worry, I will give you all the meanings that are listed. Look up these words. Write out the different meanings each word has. Remember, most entry words in me are root words, short words with nothing added at the beginning or end. If you want to look up the meanings of words like cheated, you must look up the word cheat. Fatter, you must look up the word fat. Closest, you must look up the word close. Here are more words. Write down the root word next to each word. I hope you are now familiar with my pages. Use me when you can't understand a word. Play games with words and let me help you win your games. Remember, I'm your friend and I'm always ready to help you. In addition, one more homework you have. You have a box with words to watch. Now, those are the keywords of the lesson. You will write down each word five times in your notebook and at the same time be able to memorize the spelling of each word. So, the words are wizard, described, guide, define, entry, difficulty, familiar, confusing. Thank you.